Right now, we have the rice, and the rice is actually cooking down real good. So, you know, so we have enough water in it and everything like that to make the rice go and cook. So, I just check me and check it for make sure the all the gungu them, they just stay up on one side, them all around in it. And you can see me scratch the pan the paper there on top, and the scallion. Mmm, smell real nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's up beautiful people? I hope you're having a wonderful and amazing day wherever you are in this world. Now in today's video, I'm in the beautiful community of Bethany which is located in the Litchfield community, the whole area. You know what I mean? And I'm going to visit a creative chef today. He's going to take us on his whole cooking journey. We're going to look some bird, all of that thing. You know what I mean? Um, his name is Leighton Douglas, K.A. we call him. Alkali by a boom boom. He's gonna tell us more about that name, you know. And you probably see me in a video before, but he might show us a different side of himself today. Yeah, man. So Leighton, aka by a T, Alkali by a T, boom boom, at the top man. You know what I mean? He talk I told him, the biggest chef. He cook for everybody in the community. And last but not least, guys, I wanna say a big big thank you um, for carrying me to 3K subscribers and counting. I really really appreciate that. You know what I mean? A one love from Jamaica. I am Tyrone. Um, me carry up on the cooking journey. I'm gonna see the food. When you can learn some stuff. You know what I mean? I'm me a continually do it and endorse our Jamaican culture that's for number one and for sure and big up to those who overseas everybody who is watching thus far and enjoying the program and if you're new here don't forget to like and subscribe you know what I mean tell a friend to tell a friend um, with out here and do the right thing you get me I say yeah man Blessed morning. I want to do again. But Alkali Bayete boom boom in the damn house again, you know. So here we are going today. We are going to do a little special today, yeah? We are going to do a vegan special today. We are going to do curry pumpkin, you see me? And then we are going to do some rice and gungo with some real coconut milk. But before we go into that, here we are going. We are going to hunt some bird right now, you see me? So we are going to set a little original fly up. And then we'll go into the kitchen and do what we need to do there. Dig up on the safe. We don't know say alkali by it, boom boom there, you know. You see me? And a real thing. Alright guys, so there with the boss and now. Yeah, yeah man, what, what you do for me? Right now yeah. I wanna fly up something I try to yeah. stick so you know say you can't deal with it. But this has seemed to be alright, you know? Mm. Right for the for the point right now, what I wanna do. Yeah, yeah. I'm not too big today. Yeah. You see me? So hopefully we catch one, we, we catch two birds. Yeah, no? we catch two birds just cause it, a, a, a bird season, you know. Mm. So we go down there, so down at the, the farm. Yeah. You can see how man the farm pan out one piece of part of the land. Yeah. But them just sprinkle rice and stuff. Mm -hmm. You see me if you make the birds them. And if you go down there, you can see you can yes. see one or two birds down there. Okay. You see so, me? So I just stick alone you use to make the fly up? Yeah, I stick. Stick, stick alone. Just stick alone. Say there is a string. Yeah man, I'm a piece of card. Oh, you see me, one piece of card. So right now, I'm going to look some little mm -hmm. sticks may I look right now, but I want another piece of stick, yeah. which is basically a hook. So you can use a piece for the pimento tree? No, I'm not just trying to no pimento tree right yeah, now. Say, no, I'm not jerk. We're going to jerk nothing today. <laughs> so we're not going to do that. So here I go on. Yeah, this is right supposed that. to work. Yeah, right, that. so. You see it? This is supposed to work. Yeah. Yeah, if it's a hook in there. Yeah, it's a See the people, a legend, this in man. Yeah, we have a hook in there. So yeah, we'll catch you some bird. You have, have one next, you have one next play up chop, one next chop on it. Calabash. Yeah, man. 
Let us, let us take more detail and wind yeah, up and yeah. sticks and stuff like that. Yeah, I forgot to use binding wire. Yeah, binding. You know, yeah, you can use binding wire, you but can you can use, use string. string. Oh. You can also use the old time with them. Mm -hmm. uh, the pooper lick. You see me? Yeah. Them things they used to make wicker basket and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that can I use. All so, right. they're going to the field? Yeah. Come now. All right. Forward. <laughs> All the it, they are here. Yeah. Yeah, I know. As you can see, this is almost bird shooting month. You see yeah. them, people have come and see them now farm on a party, so they just plant, put rice on it. So every morning you see birds and them things are coming here. So you see about 20 dozen birds a morning time, an even time. So right now we're going to start set up a little quick, quick fly up yeah. and deal with it properly. You see me? So here we are going. See, now I'm sick already. See in? The stick I want a nice looking stick, so I don't want to just put it in the ground. You see me? Put it in the ground. Enough children use them um, eyesight because they um, use it wrong, you know. You see me? Mm -hmm. When you set fly up, you don't want to set it in front. Yeah. You see me? You want to set it, you want to sit, set it right in the back. <clears throat> so, what, what, what are the ratio are we catching a bird today? Yo, you know, sir? Probably 10. 10? 10, yeah. Because as you can see right now, you know, see no bird, so probably them gone home. You mm -hmm. see me? Gone go cool out. But later on, mm -hmm. they will come back. Because this man, them, them the dung, yeah. Mm -hmm. And feed. Feed. Really, really good feeding. Yeah. You see me? So right now, I'm going to cook with food. Mm -hmm. But first, I'm going to set this up. Yeah. Then, we we'll are cook the food and we we'll walk down here, so. You see me? And see where I go on. You see me? So, it's best time for really catch bird are like early in the morning. Early in the morning, I mm. in the evening. I in the evening. Yeah. So, around 2 o'clock, 3. It's 3 o'clock, them time, you see me? Oh. Brother, I want to come pitch and them things there. Yeah. Okay. So, I have a stick. Alright, I have that. That, that. Hold on now. I need one more piece of stick. You see me? Alright. Ding 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 ding. So, I'm gonna measure up when we need to measure up. Uh, so, what the uh, string? The string. So, we're gonna tie the string upon this, you see? Mm -hmm. Tie it away. So, you know, say, eh. Now, I'm gonna come off. Mm -hmm. oh, tie it as strong, strong. Yeah. So, it doesn't come off. And you see me, the bird can't get away because that is the purpose. You don't want the bird to get away. Mm. Not at all. That is your dinner or whatever. Maybe if we catch him, we let him go. Because we're not. Yeah, yeah. We're not leaving nothing right now. Yes, I show you your own experience. Experience, yeah. So. Oh, is there any people want stick? Yeah, man. Right. Can I use sketch stick in it? Yeah, can I use quick stick? Mm. But here we are going. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, 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 we have that stick there. Um, let me go get a dry, dry piece of stick. All right. I'll stop. Mm -hmm. See, I'll tie on the stop. So, this I'll go have the stick. Pan it. You overstand. So this I go on something, I go so right. and touch upon that. So I go all the way just so we go cut it. Right. I'll cut this. this Again. Alright, so 
this year now uh, set it off yet it's very 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 s sticky in a sense you know I say it's very very much easy to catch the bird with this now so we're gonna do a nap see <laughs> easy as one touch it as a touch it say god yes so this is what we are gonna do we're gonna make a nap okay so the foot the bird foot hooch in it yep so the bird foot hooch in this so this one we can catch one bird at a time though. one bird at a time well you know what if we want to catch more than one bird check more than one fly up yes at one particular time mm -hmm. we could have, have over 300 dozen birds not 300 dozen him but about 12 dozen birds uh -huh. yeah at one time uh -huh. yeah and just just catch them especially white ring i had one dozen of that uh -huh. and one dozen of the bird that we're going to catch today which is the fan tail p dove okay you understand so let's put this back yes sir this yes sir as low as possible because i eat i gotta catch him you see me eat i gotta catch him Mm -hmm. You understand? Know and then you have to put the coin. Yeah, but let's put this like so a. Yeah, hold it down. Walks through here, he might touch it. If he walks through here, he might get catch. It make a difference. So, him foot got catch on it. Ah. You see? So, no matter where him try, yeah. if we go anywhere, all right, hook on for him. Alright, so. Hmm. See, expert there, guys, the bird catcher. Yeah, alkali bayete, boom, boom. Yes, sir. Reaching all here. Yeah. The master. Yeah. Hey. You see me? With some nice, nice juice. Mm hmm. I deal with it. By one o'clock, we don't cook, man. Mm. One, two o'clock. Yeah. All right. All right, guys. So, see you chop there. Yep. So, we're going to put two can. Chop well set. Yeah. We're going to put two can. You see me? Mm hmm. Make him go on up. And he must have to come here. You want him to see that? Yeah. And see kind of that, he must go there. So, to, to reinforce it so he go through it, mm -hmm. a old time people style, mm -hmm. them used to do this. Put one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, all, and up your two. Mm -hmm. So the bird can go in and catch. Right. But we're not going to do that, yeah? Mm -hmm. We're going to just do what we need to do. Right. Let me pick up two stones from your son. That means uh, when I stone, I got to go yes, so, so it doesn't go around. So it looks naturist type. You see me? Mm -hmm. Move this away. So we'll now put more corn there? No, nah, man. That we do? That we do. Look how much food there, sir. <laughs> Look how much rice there, sir. Corn him want, you know. So once him see them corn, yes, sir, mm -hmm. automatically, him have to walk over here. So when he walk yes, and touch a stick, yes, sir, mm -hmm. bam! <laughs> All right. Call see it. you two guys. I watch you. Go on. Well, you are in the kitchen now. You can't see me in the kitchen. In the kitchen, is it? So what I'm doing actually is this soak the gungo from overnight. So I soak the gungo now. Some regular water. So now I just throw off the water right now. I'm just taking out the gungo. Gungo one of my favorite something. I mean, I'm not like people. I love gungo. It's a Jamaican gungo. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Badly. What am I saying? Badly. Badly, badly. Love it. Say so nothing about the tea. Drink some tea this morning. You know? Yeah? yeah you know, the tea, the very fine tea with the ginger. Or oh, a bad. Yeah, man, you bad, man. Yeah. Fully bad. Fully bad. Sit now, put on. Very fine and ginger. And them don't know, say so very fine and ginger good for, right? Boost up your immune system. Mm -hmm. So, none of them time you have to eat good and drink good and everything. Then. See them, sir. See me? So right now I just take out some gung, the gungu them, as you can see out of the pot where I soaked from last night. That's where it is right yeah, now. Yeah, soak it with garlic. Yeah, soak it with garlic, you understand? Yeah. See the people, top chef this is man, and this is a man who cook for the whole community, you know? Yes, man. Whole yes, community, man. whole world. So, here we are going now. You look on the people, look on the pumpkin. Is the pumpkin, the pumpkin pretty? And this we have a curry now? We have a curry half of that today. The massa. Yeah, and we have to put some mixed vegetable in it and mm -hmm. you see? And this, this is just so simple and easy. Anybody can do it. Yeah. As long as you have this real Jamaican pumpkin though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. We have, Jamaican... uh, we have a surprise food in here guys. We have to cook some, some Indian dish one of these days. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, the Arawak and dish. Yes. You understand? That's how we're going to deal with them. Yes. So, here we are going now. More of a coconut. Alright, so we are stay tuned and watch what I go on my people. Alright. So the real coconut, the dreadnought. The really, really dreadnought. If you can see it here. Really, really dreadnought we have to deal with. So we have to it out and things. Because I really want the water, you know. Mm -hmm. But deal with me want to deal with it. You see? Mm -hmm. So, here we are going. Give me a few minutes. We'll soon power it. Yeah. So do me a favor. Do you hear me? I want one dish. Oh, yes. Time for greater. No, no. <laughs> you know, the greater less of the cassava. So oh. we're going to greater the greater less of the iron. Yeah, son. Yeah. See that? Yeah, we can't put that. <laughs> man. See, you're going to greater, yeah. Yeah, we're going to greater. Eh, eh, the master. Yeah. Yes, sir. Some fire in India, Mr. Garak, and I'm going to get some cassava. Right now, Mr. Cut up a coconut, you know. Yeah, no more bullets. Is it? Uh, and then we are. So we get that nice, nice look of coconut flavor in on the thing. Mm -hmm. Now, time for greater the old fashioned way my grandmother used to teach me. Yeah. And my mom, so I'm going to cut this up. Mm -hmm. Small. Put it in the booster. Yeah. We should do this now. So now we're going to strain them out. Alright. Get the spoon. This is going to blend it back up again. You know? Blend it up again, man. So. So the coconut juice is going to the peas? Yeah, man. The coconut juice. Yeah, going to the peas. Oh, that's that a gungo. That's a gungo. Yeah, and we're going to boil that down. And when you taste that gungo rice and paste, you're going to say, Whoa! And who cook this? A granny. Because the granny, they also cook them food the other than. Yeah. Whoa! When granny cook this, they look like 10 fingers. Mm. Oh, nice. Mm. Suppose I'm not 10 fingers, man. You know, if you really call your finger then, just any you know how much finger you have, you're going to lick them. <laughs> you know, you're probably going to lick them. Ah. You see me? You're going to lick them too. All right, my boss. All right, my boss. Here we are going, people. We're back again now. We have to do the finishing product. If you reached this video so far, I beg you, subscribe to it. I'll call you by here, I'll tell you that. You can always get good vegan recipe and good food and them things. You see me? Come here to make it 180 year old pudding yet. You see me on that bad two wheels, cassava and sweet potato. Anyway, just subscribe here. Yeah? Anyway, you're gonna put this on the fire now. You see me? So I click on the stove. Click on the stove, that's all. Put it on. Yep. Rinse off my cover. It on. Yes, well, I mean it on. on. <laughs> See there, it's on, it's on, people. Oh, yeah, it's a bubble. You see me? The pot soon bubble, I'm seasoning and everything. You see? Yeah. So, I rinse this off and everything. You see? Mm mm. It's a man, and we're good to go. Yeah, so what we are going to make next? Right now, mm -hmm. we have to prepare the meat. Pumpkin. The pumpkin. Yeah. That we're going to prepare. Right? All right. So now I start feeling the pumpkin. Yeah. And I start, I don't want to get rid of the coconut yet. Because if the peas not really, gungo not really cook, you still are going to need this like a bit of it. You understand? To make that like a water, they come in and put nothing else in it. Yeah. You see me? To get that flavor there. Yeah. So I'm going to rest this right there. So very quick. And guys, like up the video, you know what I mean? And subscribe. You see me? Respect with the subscribe them so far. Yeah, man. Press like. Yeah man, just go that little button there, like a thumbs up button there So more people can see the video, you know what I mean? Yeah man, share it, when you watch it, share it You don't know a thing go already, one love from Jamaica mm -hmm. All the time, you know, healthy living Alright, so again now, I'm going to use the pumpkin See the pumpkin there, so how pretty it is? You see me just cut it See the people, are the real pumpkin this, you know? The real, 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 real pumpkin So I'm ready right now, I'm going to just peel it out, okay? When I get in the pumpkin, I can just peel it out just like this, cut out the go. Yeah. You understand? And just deal with it. What we do? We're going to plant. Now save the seeds for my cousin. So we can plant. So, we just took out the seed also. 
Yeah. So, rubber peel the pumpkin. You see me? So now I cut it in pieces. You see me? So now I just peel the pumpkin, so it's regular peel. So let's peel the skin out. Just regular peel the pumpkin, that's mm. So, you guys are gonna slice the pumpkin and then look at slicer right now. We just to cut them so. But really and truly, what I do this for is just basically I wanna cut them this way. You know, dice them up. Dice them up nice and proper. Mm. I gotta wash them. So, I'm gonna cut them up so. Cut up you know, some nice little chunky pieces. We done cut the pumpkin, you understand? So we cut them in some slice like this. So what I wanna do now, wash them. You see me? Wash them. Make some water and just wash them off. And you know so make to get to cut up a piece of pumpkin, you know? A small piece. Take it to cut up. Just like a small piece. Right. So so it's a simple process. Yes, man. Simple, 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 simple. So anybody, kids love this. Now nah, I tell you, children love this. Yeah. So yeah, children love this meal. This meal is a good, 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 good meal. So now I just throw the water now, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And should we live a country? We just throw it outside. See? So now, pumpkin is there. You see me? Mm -hmm. Nice and pretty. pretty. Alright. Alright, so with the outside in the bath with the garden. Looks so skelly yeah. you, know, you know the, the black mint that's one of them. My grandmother's favorite mint. Huh? Yeah, but the stops. wind is still. Yeah, one of them stop. Cool, cool Manchester man. Skellion. You say big. <laughs> uh, so this is the skellion we just come off of the little backyard garden. Actually front yard garden. A front yard garden. Yeah, not a backyard. Front yard. Front yard. Front yard. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> the master. <laughs> yeah man, see front. the people. Yeah. Clean them up. Mm -hmm. Wash them off. They smell good. Eh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's very good man. Alright, so I get a smell look at nice. That. Ah, yeah, man, I see paper them over here, so original scotch bonnet. Yo, this is hot. Eat. It's hot. So this is one of them pepper you were going at the sauce, you know that? Yeah, and I yeah, fully bad sauce. Fully bad sauce, no. Then <laughs> pepper, yeah. You know, normal pepper. Yeah. You see me? So, what we're going to do now, see? We're going to get a regular seasoning then. Mm -hmm. You see that? Boom. Then we have our Jamaican curry. You see me? It makes you a turmeric. Yes. Turmeric. Yeah. Turmeric. Mm -hmm. That can go on. That can definitely go on. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Drop a few minutes ago. Put that back up now. Boom, 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 boom. Now. Alright. So, we're going to cut off the pepper. Give you some pepper in it. You see? If you like it hot, you can add as much pepper in it. Mm -hmm. Boss. You like hot pepper? No, no, really. No. Alright. <laughs> yeah, no. Put so yes, yeah, yeah, you have to season it up first and yeah, then, then you have to okay. season it up. Yeah, so put a little curry in it and everything like that. Now a little pepper you know, we're not going to put more than that. Kind. Yeah. But, you see me? Now, we're going to take some of this as well. Open the bigger side. You see me? Open the bigger side. Alright, boom. See me? Boss your curry. Can't boss it anyway, you want to boss it. You see me? Mm -hmm. Alright. You see, you don't season it just like how you season up your meat. If yeah. you're gonna deal with meat. You see me? If you give some curry. And that's enough curry right there, so. You see me? And then you're gonna save the curry for the pot. So now I just place it right there, so. So you're not gonna know, eh? I'm gonna rinse off my hand. You see me? Take up a fan, you know, so now. Boom, bam, 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 bam. I'm gonna stir it up. You see me? Get your seasoning in my So head. we're gonna put the, the full ingredients in the um, description box guys so you can see it so you know exactly what to put on it. 
Yeah, man, that's the yeah, regular seat. And you know, so I don't do too much of the, the seasoning, salt, and stuff like that. Yeah. So I have my regular, regular scallion. You see me? And my onion and everything. When I really put them in the then, because I'm doing that, the whole of process, process. If you realize I just want like a dry season to put night in it. Mm -hmm. And that alone, just for flavor. Because I'm not like the, the too much of every other thing, you see it? Yeah. And things are not good. Process. Yeah, guys. Process. So the best way the, the skeleton really work, you know, my grandmother always said, if you beat it, mm -hmm. you get up the seasoning and the right flavor in night and everything like that. Once you beat it. So right now, since I'm at the curry as so now, curry pumpkin, I can just cut them up. You see me? Mm -hmm. Cut, cut them up in the right and proper way. Nice sizes. And then we you see them? Yeah man. Then we have a nice onion. A nice onion in the pepper. Pick it up by the seat there. A nice onion. Alright. So the fly up, cut one. Got a nice big 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 bird. You know, as you see, he's alive. He's actually alive. You could actually just take him up now. See? He's definitely alive. And he's really really a good nice sized bird. But we're gonna let him go. What you say? What you say people. Yeah, we're gonna let him go. Uh, nice nice little bird. Give thanks and praise, my God. Take him off of this and let him go. So here you got a bird, we just take him off of the fly up. You know? So the fly up does work, so you see. Yeah. But we're not gonna kill our bird right now, you see. Bye birdie. Yeah, I'm gone. I'm gone, huh? Have a good night. Yes people, you know, subscribe. So we are chop up the onion in it now, is it? Mm -hmm. Guys and the colours, the colours are so amazing. I mean that nice orangey yellow pumpkin mixed with the green and we can see a little bit more yellow. We just need some red now. Um probably might some capsule make a sweet pepper. You know what I mean? Some reds. But the colours are amazing guys. And it smells really good. Really, really good. Time. Yes, sir. <laughs> Time right now. Boom. Oh, yeah. oh God. Fuck again, man. Take his guy. Take his guy. Sorry. Yes, sir. See the people. Easy one. So you don't know why you're not already. You have your pumpkin, you cut up your pumpkin. Then you put your little seasoned salt on it. Any one that you have. Then you put your scallion, your onion, and your thyme. You see me? Mm -hmm. And all that. I regular like your cook meat. That's mm -hmm. what you deal with. You see me? Yeah. Can't complain. Yeah. So far away. Mm -hmm. So right now, yeah, if you reach so far in the video, subscribe and then put a thumbs up, man, until you like it. See? So here we are now. Things are going on. Peace. The gungo are going on cooking up. So let me just t test one of them. See that? Yeah. So right now, before we do anything else, let me make it go and simmer down. But right now, I'm going to just deal with the, the pumpkin. You see me? I'm going to put some oil in the pot. You see me? And use 100% vegetable oil. You see me? Because I love the organic thing, you know. That's where it is right now. Healthy eating, you see it? Mm -hmm. Right there. Yes, so massa. Make it go on. Ray, 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 ray. Here, what I'm going for me now. See, I'm going to drop the garlic in it. In where? Nah, pot make it hot. Yes, I'm not gonna do that, but make it go on hot up real quick. Okay. Cause I like to cook with a lot of garlic, you know, and onion and stuff like that. But right mm -hmm. now, I'm gonna just deal with the peas, the peas pot. So I have me like a scallion then. You see? Put my scallion in there. Hot, you know? What? <laughs> but you don't know it's in Africa, so you have to be tough all over it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so yeah, easy. That's all. Stay tuned, guys. I'll watch everybody with it. Yeah. <laughs> I will see what you're doing. So, we're gonna put some garlic in it, you know? Yes, some garlic in it. Cut them up. Yeah, cut up the garlic if you want. I'll give it. Yeah. All right, so we're right now, since that, I'm gonna burn the curry as well. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm burning a curry. Be a vibes in our kitchen, yeah, people. Yeah. Be a vibe. And then I got dash in one of them. What? Oh, and yeah, ginger. ginger. Cut up the ginger in there. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Guys, you want to smell that? Nice. Then we got the spoon and some and stir it up. Stir it up in it. See? So you put your curry in it, your oil, then you put the curry, you put the garlic in it. I make it just go and burn, you see it? It go and burn in it. And then we there. So all of this now I got to be in at the food. So once you have that going on now, your pumpkin, remember say the season of your pumpkin, just like you don't do meat with your skelly and your onion and everything already, you know. So you need to put this in there so. So you just put this in there so now. Just put it in there pot. And make it go on. You see me? Make it go on right there so. So what we are going to do now. Alright. I get some water, put it in the pot. Yeah. So. Now I'm going to make this go on fry up. You see me? Make it go on fry up and stuff like that. Make it go on fry up. So make it stay there so. Make it go on fry up before me add in the water. So right now, I'm going to look for the covering and cover them up. Make it go and simmer and then we just dash in the water. So now, I'm going to just check the peas at the same time too. You see me? Give them up my spoon, I'm going to rinse them off and the water. See? No smell. Smell nice. Now smell it to the phone. Eh? Now smell it. Now smell it. Come in, man. Smell it to the video. Smell it. See there? See it? So now I'm going to test this now. I'm going to test it. Then I just add the milk. You need to cook it down a little bit more. But I dash that in so. So now I'm going to add a little bit of thyme. My fat, we can taste it. Taste that's what I need. Alright, I'm going to need my salt. But we're not going to put no salt. No. See, see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we're back again, right? So we're going to do the rice now. We're going to put in the rice, right? So now I'm going to measure the rice. My fat, no time. This is a good cut. So how I measure the rice? Since I have four we here, so I'm gonna use four cups. When you get this, you can never run. Um, pour them glass, yeah. Huh? Equals you can feed the four of us here. Cause sometimes you don't like to overcook. Uh, you yeah, understand? Then we eat it. So four of these and then I'll wash the rice and put another pot. Two. I got a tree. I got a tree. Mm. Yeah, I got a tree. I got a tree. So we use three of these, right? Water. That's what I do right now. Just I wash the rice, you know. You see me? Wash it real good. You see it? So you wash it so. And then you're gonna just put in the rice on the pot and I'm gonna show you how, we, how you know when you have enough rice in the pot or less water in the pot. You see me? So I'm gonna just put in the rice now. You see me? Wash it already. You see me? See the rice are going on the pot, you see? And we'll put thyme and skill in the pot already and we just season it with a little seasoning you know, we have already, you know. You see me? So right now I just the rice, so I'm gonna put another pot and making sure so we get all the rice and everything in it, you see it? Mm -hmm. And the type of rice that we are using? The type of rice we're using pole boy rice. You understand? We love pole boy rice. We don't love them white, white other rice there. It don't make no sense to me. I like rice but you know so you hear me now. It have Body, and that's how you eat it. 15 minutes later, now from now, you're not hungry. You understand? So, that's where it is right now. Drain this off. All right, get all the rice. Now, I'm gonna put, nah, put this on. See him? Now, you see that fork, you know. You see the fork? The fork, you can tell me now when you have enough rice in the pot or water in the pot. You see, so you want to stir it up with a fork. Yeah. You see me? So, once you, you put your fork in it. You see how it stand up? That means that the water and everything is alright and the rice alright. So you put it as a top. Anyhow, the, ri the rice or the fork just sinks up, 
That means say you need to do something, you need to add more rice to it. You understand? So, when we just cover it up, you see me? Now, this is a simmer down, right? You see it? It's a curry you now. So right now, what we want to do now, I just turn it a little bit. Alright? Now, what we want to do now, we're going to add some water to it. Add some water to it. Just slowly pour the water in at it. You don't want too much water in there. You want that amount of water, can I say? Yeah. That's enough water right there. And if not, we can put a little bit more in there. Because right now, yeah, put a little bit more in there. Am I good? Then, I take some of my mixed vegetable. You see me? And just put it in it. Nice and properly. Nice and proper. Yeah. Make the mixed vegetable go and deal with that. You see me? Alkali Bayete cooking a vegan dish today, seeing pumpkin, um, curry pumpkin with gungu rice and peas. Boom! Alright, so welcome back. If you reach this far, see, subscribe again. You see me? So, right now we're gonna make some juice, right? We're gonna try to hunt the pine man, but the pine man never come like me. So, we're gonna hunt. We do carrot. We're gonna do carrot and beetroot today. So, we're gonna just put it in us up. Some water. You understand? And then. I'm going to just blend it up. Put a little bit more water in it. Put it up to about to the rim there, so. You see me? Right now I want bullet now you. I'm supposed to have one bullet. You know bullet? Bullet fast. You fast like bullet? <laughs> Here we are going now. I'm going to plug it in. So, let's plug it in. Alright. Boom. Let's plug it in now. Good to go. And the bullet there, pull it up. So today we are drink beetroot and carrot with ginger. And we're going to alkaline way. Look at the alkaline. Lime. Real, real lime. Pick from the tree in my, back, in my backyard. We get the time now on Skellion in the front yard, but we have a backyard there, sir. Full of beer. It's good, good things. You see it? So, so right now, we're going to deal with what we need to deal with, you know? Alright. Get some water. Now, if you're at home, may I use a strainer, you know? You understand? I really, really, really good Jamaican strainer. But, I also use like this 110 mesh. This is what I used to do screen printing. You see me? So I'm gonna put it over here to get rid of some of the extra trash I'm gonna really want in my juice. So my juice becomes smooth. So anything when I do, I wanna do it on the yard too. You understand? You get the strainer, you, get, you can't go to any fabric store until you say you want the 110 mesh. And then give you a piece of it, see? Now this you get rid of all the trash in your juice. Because sometimes the strainer. Not good enough. You see me? So watch you now. Bust that off. See there? Good to go. Take some more beetroot and carrot. Put in the blend. Now the bullet here. Yeah? See me? Good to go, like a piece of ginger. So, blend. Eh. So, we're going to strain this up. I'm going to show you how this 110 mess work, right? Watch how it works. Alright, let's take this up. You get that extra, extra, extra grip that we really want. That nothing jugs or nothing going on it. So you just take your time and just ring it, squeeze it out. And you're gonna see it. And if you don't want your beetroot to be like watery, you take back the same liquid. Like sometimes I just do this twice. Once I do this, twice, alright? Mm, it out real good, get all the juice so you want out of it. Mm. So to make your juice look watery, you see me? You pour back some of this. 
And then you're gonna blend your juice. You're gonna blend some more in this so you just take some. Take your time. So then you cock it back up and then you're gonna start with blending. But we just want money to turn something fresh, right? Mm -hmm. So now we're there so in the kitchen again, you see? And I tell you the rice, the rice is bubbling. See there now, you see the pepper still damp up. I remember you now, we use three cups of rice. And instead of the rice full, imagine me use four. You see it, it pop over and everything like that. So right now, I steam it, I steam the fire down low and everything. So this is done cooking now. You see me? Yo, mm -hmm. right about now, I'm gonna taste some of it, yeah? You want to taste some camera man? You can taste it man. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Mr. Man really like taste my cooking because I don't know how it tastes already you know that. You see me? Hot. Hot. <laughs> yeah. Yo. Guys. You want to put the hot rice in here. Alright. Cool it first. Cool it first. You cool it first? You All cool right. it. You cool it. <laughs> taste it my boss. Alright. I'm going to sound pretty. Yeah. Taste it. <laughs> <laughs> mm, hot food. <laughs> hot right. food. It's bad. Yeah, hot food. I don't know what you put in there, but it's sweet and nice. Yeah, mm -hmm. it, you know what I put in there to make it nice? Yeah. The coconut. Bad. Coconut. The coconut. The coconut. Mm -hmm. yeah, man, the coconut. Mm -hmm. Guys, you want to taste the rice and the goongo here. Yeah. It's bad. Fully bad. <laughs> mm -hmm. But yo, I know what's going on with the video and I say, yo, I don't want to taste this in the bud. You know what I mean? I, I call it. I yeah. want to send somebody playing with them. Yes, man. I can send them the recipe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I send them. Me, me, next thing to me, I'll cook some and I'll package it and send it overseas for them. If you don't want this mm -hmm. Jamaican, real Jamaican cooking, <laughs> real coconut <laughs> with the gumbo rice and peas, people. <laughs> in blood. What me say? In the blood of the sauce, you know. But this bad, 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 bad. <laughs> Holy man, holy man, pulling until everything good. Yeah? Yes, everything sir. Woo! <laughs> yeah, man. Since you reach this far now, you can really push that subscribe button. You see me? And give me a likes. So right now we are gonna just make some finish, blend up the juice and everything. You know. So we're gonna put some alkaline in this. You see me? So basically we're gonna use lime. See me? So I use about two already. You know. So I'm gonna use three. Well, maybe I'm gonna use three. I'm gonna use four. You see me? To get that, that tangish flavor that you're looking for. And right now, lime them in Jamaica, them ready and nice. You see me? You go to the market right now, you have lime that. You, you have lime for stone dark. <laughs> you hear me? You go down there so you pick up lime underground. Mm -hmm. Right up on the ground, how the lime is going to drop Yeah, you have the ginger in it already. Yeah, I have the ginger. So I have beetroot, carrot, and ginger. I just squeeze some lime in it. See? So, we're going to use the. The Jamaican sugar, brown sugar, the real, 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 real good Jamaican. You can't call it a Jamaican gold. I don't know. <laughs> brown sugar? Nah. Yeah. I just the brown sugar I got use, see? You know, I use too much sugar. You see that? One, two. So that alone, if you can look on it, this is beetroot and carrot. You see that now? This is a really good something for your kidney. You see me? So yeah. Your eyes. And your eyes, yeah, yeah exactly. Your eyes, yeah. And the beta carotene in the carrots, so you don't know say all that night. Nice. Good for you already. The what? Beta carotene. Oh, uh, okay, what well, good for? Beta carotene is something that's good for your body, you know, like for your eyes and stuff. Yeah. So yeah. And the next, we can problem. add this tea, the next thing with beetroot is a good detox agent. Yes, man. Your body sometimes yeah. you can clean, clean out your kidney. Detox, yeah. So, right now, Tyro, where are you going to cup the your glass? My cup is over there somewhere. We're not ready for filming yet. We're going to make it chill, but I taste more and taste this. Yeah, right. taste it. See you see me? Say, look, good night, glass. Ding, ding, ding. We taste it. Nice. Yeah. See? Not, not more, too not sweet. Less. Yeah, not too sweet. Anyway, I'm going to taste the lime in it, but I'm going to taste the ginger. Oh, yeah. man. Lemon and ginger. Yeah. Good combination. That yeah. Means. So here we are going now. See, eh? We're going to make a chili in the refrigerator. Then we'll make a potato salad. 
And then we'll go. We'll just have to take a few minutes to break and see what I'm going. So, you say, you have a hundred dollars for your bird? Yeah, man. Alright. But then I'm about to share what right now. If you look at my potato salad, you see it? Nice, 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 nice. I put my money on. You know, if you make potato salad, but the potato salad here is sweet potato and Irish potato together. You understand? So, let me just clean off the local table. And you can see me pour some of the beetroot already, you know. You see me? And everything. So, the corn pumpkin can it cook. You see me? So, we are going to share out everything right now. Alkali, Bayete, boom, boom. Put a like up for me, you see me? Yeah, so we are dishing out the food now. And you can see the rice. The rice is very shelly, you see it? And you know what make it shelly, sir? My hands. And you know the rice full up, sir? My hands. You see, my man swell the rice a lot, you know? So I'm going to take out them like a sticker, you see me? That's from the time. And if you can look on it, I want to gungo them, the gungo them evenly. Shouldn't have the pot. So, how much rice you want, my boss? Because it's not, me not a rice fan, you know? How much rice you want? Yeah, man, that, that hot, man. That nice. That nice? Yeah. Alright. You are going now. Boom. Guys, see there? Curry, curry pumpkin. pumpkin. Curry pumpkin. You see? Curry. Mm -hmm. Fully bad. Yeah. I put the good gravy up on your eyes there. Yeah, man. See it there, guys. You see me? Pretty. Mixed vegetable. Pretty. You see me? Yeah, guys. See it there, the curry pumpkin. I mean, it's the first I'm gonna try curry pumpkin. I've eaten pumpkin with other stuff, but the curry pumpkin. Yeah, man. And we're gonna get a little dash of um, potato salad. Yeah. yeah. Also, Leighton made his special um, coleslaw. No mayonnaise in this one, no. it's a little bit of lime. No. Lime, alkaline. If you look yes. one so this is a cabbage and some. You call it now, this now? A little bit of carrots. Carrots! So you know, say <laughs> good for you. you yes, understand? guys, that you must put a whole clump on my plate. Come on, carrot, I have blood in Yes, guys, look at that beautiful food. Yeah, man. Energy, this one. Beautiful. You see me? So you don't, you don't know the same food, yeah? Same food, yeah? Yeah. Curry pumpkin, mashed potato, my special local vegetable, my own sauce. You see me, the nice, nice gungo rice and peas, Jamaican way, with the coconut. Yo, the recipe are there now yeah. after we finish here. Yeah, sure yeah. and, and this guy, they took about an hour to cook, an uh, hour or less. Yeah, a hour or less. Yeah, to yeah, cook. No, you know, so it's, it's a very one pot one that easy meal prep. Very. Any anybody who can try, you don't have to be 100% vegan to eat this, cause we're not 100% vegan, but we like to eat a balanced diet. Plus the beetroot and carrot. Yes. Bad for your ear. Yeah. Good for your whole organ and everything like that. So, so stay tuned. We're gonna go outside and we're gonna eat. All right, guys. All right, guys. So here, we are. this is the moment you have been waiting for. The food moment. Mm -hmm. See me there, so with the boss right now. See him. Him sit down in him chair. Oh, yeah, come on, like it's a jacuzzi, you know. You see it? Yeah, I mean, I say so. Mm -hmm. Seafood, yeah? So, curry I'm pumpkin, man. Curry pumpkin, yes, so man. this is the first thing I got taste. Curry pumpkin. I'm going to curry pumpkin and see it taste. So, give me. Mm -hmm. Taste it with the rice now. Taste it with the rice? Oh, taste it with the rice. All right. Mm -hmm. Guys, yeah. how's the vegan food boring? How? Mm -mm. Can't bore you, don't you? No. A rasta cooking, you know? Yeah, I'm boring. A rasta cooking, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. rasta the first vegan. Guys, mm -hmm. let me tell you how this tastes. The pumpkin tastes creamy and it's it not too soft. As it goes in your mouth, it melts. Mm -hmm. Plus, the, the colors are so appealing to your eyes. Remember, we as Jamaicans are Caribbean, are humans overall. We eat with our eyes. Yes, you get me I say so it's really let me bring it up a little closer to the camera if you guys can see show them, show them the um the, uh, yeah. the mashed potato salad around you so around you so yes, you see it? It? yes this mashed yeah. potato salad but. here yes so i have to turn all the plate mm -hmm. you know what i mean but it it, it it has a it has a flavor like when the turmeric in the curry plus the scallion and the thyme on the pepper i did the two pepper so that's why i love about it yeah. Cause I don't really love too much pepper in That's what I asked you earlier, say if you yes. eat pepper, you say no. I not really too love pepper. too much pepper. All right. Plus the mixed veggies, let me taste it. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. So we really like people. <laughs> The juice. This is not a rice fan, you know, but just when gungu in the rice and peas, me eat it, no fight. Mm -hmm. You see me, me just want me basically me, me potato and me, mm -hmm. me vegetable. And after that, me good to go, man. Me no want nothing more than that. You see me, me a juice go. man. Mm -hmm. Guys, this is so amazing. You can try this on your own. The recipe is very easy. It is delicious. I mean, it is the, the, the mashed potato. The, the potato salad, I should say, wicked, fully bad. Eh? Mm -hmm. Imagine if the fully bad sauce is the potato. What? You know something? We shall make the way name there now. Mm -hmm. The other Romaine lettuce. Yeah. And then put it on it and yeah. put the, the, the bad. sauce on it. Bad, bad, bad. The sauce. The fully bad can go over for anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, come over fish, salad, yeah. hot dog. And talk about fully bad, guys. Fully bad sauce is soon come out on the market. Yeah, December. Yes, yeah, so we are going to launch the sauce there. Mm -hmm. It's it good for jerk, everything. So we are going to launch it and we are going to show you what go on. You get me, I say? Plus, those who want fever grass, those who want the. What the tea name we you met this morning? Oh, that I am um, winning. Then. Oh, wow. Vervine? Vervine with ginger. Mm -hmm. So, on the vervine, we are going to put late number in the description box so you can contact him. And, guys, I want to give a shout out to one of my church brother. I have a YouTube channel, they call themselves Yash, my wife and I. So I put him link in the description box. I put a little bun across so you can see him. Channel, go over there, give him a strength. I do the right thing, like how I try to do the right thing. You know what I mean? But the best thing right here, so, yeah. are the food. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to the juice and now. See it here? Yeah. Original beetroot. Yeah, beetroot. Ain't not too sweet either. Uh -huh. Start it up. Yeah. Cause you don't know say so the coconut and everything nice. You see me? Ooh. Guys, the lime and ginger. <laughs> I don't need no milk because you know so I no, love milk, no. you know. So I'm not drinking too early see me use milk on that channel because my lack to us, you know. So. Yeah. Mm. I don't think them tell someone milk. Mm. Milk. Yo, the breeze out are so nice. Yeah. Well, well nice. Nah lie. Mm. Well, well, well nice out so. You know why? You know why I love a juice because as you go, it fool your belly. Yeah man. <laughs> <laughs> no, no food right now. Just, belly, just, man. just drink juice. Mm -hmm. Me's a juice man. Me's a juice man. Me drink half beer juice. You see me? Natural juice too. But people, I beg you to subscribe and give me some likes. You see me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you don't know my number and the recipe and everything every night. And if you want the the, the, the fever grass, yeah, we have enough abundance around here. So we have the fever grass, we have the aloe and stuff like that. And you know, so I come up with that ear oil. But I don't speak too soon. But I come out with a hair oil using some bees product. You understand? The byproduct of bees. And them weird. Mm -hmm. So I come up with a lixture too. You see Mr. Look out feet in 2022. Yeah. About 2022. Right now I just put up some business um they can't call on the business ideas, business proposal to some people. And then they go check Rada and make Rada help me out with the sauce and get it properly. Then I'm going to go by the SRC, which is the Scientific Research Center in Jamaica to make it approved and everything. So when it touch upon the market, it's going to have the CMTS and everything will go there. Big up on yourself. I love it here. <laughs> All right. Yeah, man. Mm. Mm -mm. Bad. Curry pumpkin now. Fully bad. Oh, bad, man. Bad. Fully, fully bad. Man. Mm. I'm going to give you some. Take some. <laughs> <laughs> some kind, you know. Take some, man. Yeah, man, it's bad. Plus the salad, we are mixing three of them together now. Rice? Rice with pumpkin, pumpkin with salad. Salad, taste it. Mm. You taste it, Bessel? Wow. Oh, wow. Mm. Wow, 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 wow. I know some of extra, you know, people, you know that. But when food, food bad, good, man. food, food good. I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. Damn, food bad. Once I teach a recipe to my cousin, he might always have it. Come and tell him, say, yo, make like, say, Monday is a no meat day in our calendar. You know, so you eat meat in the week or right? make one day for the week. Monday, no meat. You see me? Like how you don't cook your rice and peas and then you have your Sunday, Monday. Use the pumpkin instead of the chicken. Use the pumpkin instead of the meat. You hear? Mmm. Then we are there. Good to go, yeah, people. Love. <laughs> Guys, I want to thank you very much for watching today's session. Um, I hope you learned something. Don't forget to like, comment, share, 
um try the recipe send me a little clip a one minute 30 second video of you trying and cooking and i will show your videos at the beginning of my videos so i like the community building you know what i mean one love from jamaica this is tyrone this is alkali bayete boom boom and i will see you guys in the next video and we are out <laughs> <laughs>